So I met Wolfen in, in Los Angeles and like five, six years ago, he invited me to cook to his restaurant at, at the Bel Air Hotel. And since then we've been doing every year in September a, a fire cookout in the gardens uh, where we cook together with some other chefs. And it became immensely popular because nobody in Los Angeles had that, you know, to cook with fire like that. So I said, wow, this is really interesting. Somebody who does even more on fire than I did. Since then, um, we've been talking about uh, him visiting South America. Saltelmo con Wolfgang. It's the first time I came to South America and I came to Buenos Aires. I was impressed how beautiful the city is with big parks and beautiful buildings, very clean, very sophisticated. I think the restaurants are great, there are great bars. I love to learn all the time and experience new things. This is an exchange, um, a cultural exchange, so you know, there's complete freedom for him to do whatever he wants. I really want to experience how people live in the countryside. And I think for me to come here to Carson is really special because you're totally in the countryside. You have to rely on all your local purveyors and see how people really work and live here. It's an interesting way of living to be connected to the earth. So we organized two events. One for lunch at the Bodega Garzón of Mr. Bulgeroni up in the hills, and then another one here at the hotel in, in the plaza. I said, okay, let's use everything local. Let's get the local lamp. Don't bring anything from the United States. Entonces, un plato clásico que de verdad cuenta la historia completa de Welcome. Thank you. Cheers. It's very strong, I think, for both sides, you know, because we We've been together a lot, uh, talking a lot, seeing how each one of us works. So yes, it's, it's very beautiful, it's very inspiring. I think for me, fire is really a big part of cooking. And I'm surprised to see Francis took it to a whole other level, you know. He's the master of it. We are more brutal in our cooking, uh, in a way. Uh, we use fire in many, many different ways. Uh, you know, we cook in ashes, we cook in a little hell, we cook uh, under the earth with fires, and he is more related to cooking in a grill in a wood oven. Here, the variety with fish, with vegetables is so interesting, and that's really an important part. So you get it really fresh, so if you have great ingredients, you don't need a lot of things to do with it. You just keep them simple. I think that what he will take from here is, is the happiness, you know, that is related to a way of living. The idiosyncrasy of Argentina and Uruguay is the beauty of, of, of happiness and, you know, the relationship between people and how we host people and how we embrace people and so on. So I think that's a very strong impact that he will have from us. What I love about Francis cooking, it has his own personal style. He exported it worldwide, he cooks all over the world, and people love it. So it made a big impact, and I think people were very happy with his food, yeah. Francis really started something here to show people, you know what, we have great ingredients, we can do a great restaurant with all the local ingredients. So it's for a chef, it's actually a great place to be.